I need to see my father. How? I have to become the tribrid. Are you talking about a resurrection spell? Necromancy is the darkest and most dangerous of the sacred magics. The spell requires an offering for the dead to rise. You need the sacrifice hard. Balance out the cosmic forces. You're talking about more power than anyone has ever had. And no matter how strong you are, you are still your father's daughter. The heart you need must come from something. And I'm gonna be here with you every step of the way. And got so far. We stay with me one. It doesn't need to so I had to What kind of thing? To lose it all. The heart of the thing you love most. In the end, it doesn't even matter. You have to ask yourself a simple question. How far are you willing to go? <laughs> That's what I have to figure out. place right now you have no idea where i'm at see i thought that i was prepared to become the tribrid to kill landon for all the emotions that would bring your grandmother turned me into a vampire once i know how it feels why didn't you turn it off because that's never the answer isn't it My humanity flipped the second that sword went through Landon. But I gotta say, it really seems to be working for me. Like I'm so sick of being controlled by my emotions. It's like, love, lose, breathe, repeat. I am finally free. You can run, but you can't hide. 
Hello? Who's there? Hope Andrea Michaels. Are you going to help me? I'm guessing you gotta run in with the tribrid. Yeah, we met. I'm looking for a Greg. Yeah, well, you found him. Why are you here, Caroline? Rebecca called, actually. I'm responsible for an entire school full of kids, including yours. But hope. Is she. What? Had enough? Now that you mention it, yeah. Douchebag in the corner pocket. Doc's in a coma. Our blood. I can't wake Dr. Saltzman up. What did you do? <laughs> Magic in the poison. So it goes. Do you have any idea what you've done? To kill Landon. I've got you back. Well, it isn't the happy homicidal maniac. If you've come to give me a lecture, save it. I've had enough of them today. You're not yourself. I am. You're still learning what you are. This. It's not you. We'll see about that. Didn't know I could do that. Cool. You've lost your heart inside this war. Never give up, don't, I don't give know what up to now. Do. There's still hope in the darkest hour. And I really Never wish up, that you were here to tell me. I'm not giving up on you, class. Never <sighs> wolf. I will pull you through. I need your help, Caroline. You oh, what do you need from me? I need your daughters. I have killed many, many people for far less than what you've done, leaving me no hope of absolution. Don't worry, that's about to change. It's not a fate I wish for you. Too late? Right now, she's out there, alone, fighting darkness. Oh, please. Why won't you just go away? You brought me back. Hope is in trouble. We can't just turn our back on her. Screw Hope. If she was here right now, I would kill her. Caroline, please. Caroline. I'm begging you. Oh, this would be so much easier if you just stayed the big bad one. Don't go. Our father is in a coma. And you're more concerned about the person who put him there? Dad wouldn't want us to give up on hope. We can still work together. Always and forever. Fine. I'll tell you all about being the bad guy. Oh, this is gonna be fun, right? Right. Scared yet? Vampires of New Orleans. I can assure you, your ends would be spectacular. Stop moving so much. Close eyes your eye. Go on, sweetheart. Wait, 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 wait. You can't kill me. No, I'm going to. I'm literally doing it right now. Let it all out. Sandia. You're a long way from home. As angry as I am about what you did to my dad, we're here to help. Unbelievable. Betrayal. Seriously, Dad? Believe me, it's for our own good. That's the spirit. 
do it. Lizzie, we are not murderers. I came here wanting to make you hurt, like you hurt all of us. Seeing you in front of me, I, oh, I hate this. I hate how many good memories I have of you. But most of all, I hate you for being my friend. At the moment. I know you're in there. And I know you can hear me. So I want you to listen very carefully. You are my daughter. You are Michaelson. And you are strong and brave. Unlike anyone I've ever known. Welcome home, little one. It's going to be good to have you back. If that was some veiled reference to my humanity. It's like I keep telling everybody, it's never coming back. We'll see about that. Your humanity is flickering, Hope. It's trying to return. Drugs on people. Um, I'm having the opposite problem. I feel like I may actually be starting to feel things. Just stop. So should you. This is not a nightmare. Then what the hell is it? Besides insufferable, astral projection. What's the definition of humanity? What would you call someone who could kill a person without ever meeting them before? You'll miss the show. Hey, beautiful. Oh, let's try. I'm not going to be sharing my feelings. Stop trying to appeal to my humanity. That bitch is gone. Looks like I'm just in time. Yeah. More like late. I'm tired of turning around and not being surprised. Then don't bother. I'll happily come to my favorite place. The Michaelsons have done terrible things over the centuries. In that respect, we are very much the same. Where we differ is that we've all come to realize that no matter how powerful we are, our greatest strength is family. Listen. I've not lived an honorable life. You know that. I was cruel. I was mean. I would revel in the terror which I inspired in others. But hope, from the moment I saw you, I wanted nothing more than to be worthy of being your father. I love you deeper than the oceans and the skies. Did it work? I'm still here. I don't know about that. Because now I'm here too. father's daughter, not you. And today reminded me of how much he and my family love and have sacrificed for me. I have to be worth that. And I won't be if I keep letting you set the world on fire instead of living up to what you were meant to be. You're just a phase. And in case you haven't noticed, I'm over it.
No matter how near or far apart, apart. I'm so sorry. It's my fault. I can't do this. Dad, I can't do this. All you can do is move on. He's gone. Um, this is how we should honor him. Are you gonna be okay? Are you? I'm gonna need your help. I'll always be here for you. With me. Always and forever.